I'm gonna give this one more shot. Hello everybody, I am back. I think I film once a year, every year. Greg is laughing at me right now. <laughs> My last video was I'm back and I moved and here I am one year later, I am back and I moved again. <laughs> so I actually feel kind of nervous making this video. To be completely honest, Greg's in the corner there and he's smiling at me because he knows I'm definitely nervous. Hi. He's making lunch right now. So this video is really informal and it's gonna be very quick. So if you hear Greg making our Caesar salads, please don't mind. I actually am surprised I feel so weirdly nervous doing this. I think it's because it's important to me. So anyways, a summary of this very quick video is that I will be posting videos again, not consistently and not nearly as beautifully and professionally as I did when I had my whole CPA channel because they're going to be really informal and that's what I really miss about YouTube is the creative aspect of it, but it felt like I couldn't post those really random silly videos that I wanted to just because I made what I believe to be like such a successful CPA accountant based channel. And I still am an accountant. I'm actually a senior right now, still in public accounting. I've been working remotely and enjoying it a lot. Like I've been so comfortable. But yeah, I don't want to film about accounting anymore. I enjoy accounting nine to five, give or take. And it's something that I don't want to incorporate into a side hustle anymore, even though I definitely appreciate that chapter for what it was. So in the last year, while I was off of YouTube, deleted my Instagram, and I really just put my head down and enjoyed life. I did two major road trips. I went to Tennessee in the spring after busy season. And yes, it was inspired by Morgan Wallen. I love his country music. And then I also went to South Dakota with my boyfriend at the time but now he's my husband she's a wifey <laughs> and we moved to rhode island hence my second move my idea for this channel is when i went to the cpa exams i knew it was going to be a lot of hard work and i knew it could be something that was unenjoyable but i really exploited the pro the progress by making videos and like romanticizing it and i really just exploited something that could have been crappy and I kind of want to have the same take on with living in Rhode Island because as I mentioned, I visited Tennessee this spring and I loved it so much. And I definitely kind of had the dream that Greg and I would move like down south. So I was kind of thinking for this YouTube channel, I want to like exploit still being a Yankee and living in Rhode Island and up in New England. So I think my videos will be like vlogs and enjoying homemaking, enjoying the beauty of Rhode Island. I'm visiting the Newport mansions tomorrow, actually, if the weather's okay. So, but also my videos might just be me making smoothies or oat milk or trying out fun new recipes because I love doing that. So I do feel like weirdly nervous still and it's because I really don't like the sit down formal videos. I did that so much in my CPA accounting days. I just wanna have fun with videos again and I feel like I really deprived myself of that. And I've been thinking about YouTube for the last two years, I'm not even joking. Greg has heard it so many times, like I wanna do this, but I don't feel like, I don't feel authentic doing it and I hate doing things that aren't authentic. I don't know, I'm kind of excited for this. I'm actually going to push myself to do 10 videos and like reassess if it's still bringing me joy or whatever. So, you know, life is a process. Um, I have notes here of like what I wanted to mention and keep it short. I just wrote down like part of life is growing and you know, starting over is okay. It's not that deep that I built like what I thought was a really successful little accounting community and it's okay to start over. And I just wanna say, if you were there for just the accounting, you probably won't see that very much in the future, but I'll always answer questions if you ask me as long as it's not too personal. And I might chat about my work day a little bit, but I won't be like professionally exploiting it so much anymore. And um, I'm sure my, I had like such like beautiful linear growth in my YouTube channel, which was so satisfying to me. And I'm sure like filming oat milk one day and then like going to a mansion the next day will probably be a little bit like different and messy, but that's okay. I just really miss the creative aspect of it. Like embroidering and drawing can only get me so far. I really liked YouTube, like video editing. So that is it. I will be eating a Caesar salad in like 10 minutes. 
and this weekend I mentioned we're going to the Newport Mansions. Tonight we're making some tacos with friends. Is this enough for the both of us? Yeah, that looks like enough lettuce. Yay! Some lettuce. So amazing. And yeah, that's that's all she wrote, kids. So I hope you love the Christmas tree. I certainly do. It brings me a lot of happiness every morning. Um, we antiqued in Rhode Island. I love antiquing. So, yeah, I'm really excited about this chapter and I feel so liberated that now nobody's gonna be surprised if they see a really random video of me trying out a video of like making oat milk because I just love silly, funny little projects like that to edit and see what comes of it. So, thank you guys for watching and if you stick around, awesome. If you aren't as interested, it's okay to unsubscribe. Um, but I hope you guys all have a very Merry Christmas and are having a beautiful holiday season.